Alright everyone, so we are back here on the good old Club Penguin, LA Penguin Force. Uh, we have uh, here this uh, wooden basket with apples, I think. Uh, or they are tomatoes, I have no idea. And uh, uh, let's uh, continue our adventure here. So let's talk to Dot. Oh, hello, Tiger of Wind. It's good to see you. Good to see you too. Hi, Dot. Any progress on the investigation? No, but the director is planning an expedition in search of Chi. I'm waiting for my team to assemble. Did you find out anything about the key that broke? Yes, in fact, I found someone who can help us fix it. Excellent, I'm positive that's the key to G's room. Well, there's only one way to find out. Let's go get it fixed. Are you ready to continue the investigation? Yes, I'm ready. Alright. So, mission 5. All's well, that ends well. Get Flair to help fix the broken key to Gary's room. Alright, sounds awesome. Let's go. Alright, so we have here PH. GD agent, Dot told me about your problem. Where is she? Hey PH, Dot is out on a mission. She said you could help fix a broken key. Well, I can't, but this puffle can. Tiger of Wind, meet Flair. This puffle doesn't look uh, as cheerful as the others. Black puffles are the strong, silent type, but watch this. Oh, she gave him a berry. Oh, what happened? Wait, what's the matter, Flair? Uh, let's sh see. Flair can barely make a flicker of light. I need to find out what's putting out its flame. Oh, let's see. We have here a uh, fire extinguisher, I think. Let's talk to PH once again. Something seems to be wrong with Flair. Any black bubble should be able to light up into a fireball just like that. What do you think is the matter? I'm not sure. Flair spends a lot of time at the coffee shop. Maybe a friend there could help? What can I do? I'll stay here and take care of Flair. You go see what the poor Puffle's been up to. Oh, alright. Uh, we have here also an anvil. I know this key will light me into Gary's room. I just need to find a way to fix it. And I don't know if you can hear it, but my cat is outside <laughs> meowing. I think he wants to get inside, I, I have no idea. But uh, yeah, let, let me finish this mission first. And we have here Antarctic too. Let's see, hi there, it's a beautiful day, don't you think? Hi Antarctic, how are you? I am very well, thank you. Just taking a waddle before I start work on this week's newspaper. Do you know uh, who I should talk to about puffles? There happens to be a penguin at the pet shop who knows a lot about caring for puffles. It's good talking to you, Antarctic. You look like you have a lot on your mind. Is something wrong? I'm trying to help a puffle who is acting a little strangely. I adore my puffles, and I always say that a little kindness goes a long way. That is good advice. Thanks, Antarctic. I'm glad that you feel that way. Here, why don't you take this postcard? It's the least I can do to help you a fellow penguin. Thanks, Antarctic. That's very kind. Alright. Nice, a pretty cool postcard. I wonder who I could give this card to. Oh, well, I have an idea. But let's check out the coffee shop first. I'm sorry, not time to talk. I tipped this bag over and spilled the beans. Oh, uh, maybe I can help. There's a lot on the floor, so let's see. I guess now it's fresh ground coffee. <laughs> what can I use to clean up this mess? Well, I have here this uh, mechano duster. Yep. Uh, let's clean out these beans. What do we have here? Uh, it's like a pen or something. Is this a pen? Let's see. Nito, a pen. Oh, it's actually a pen and a sweet. Postcard, thank you, alright. Incredible, you cleaned up all those beans really quickly. Thanks for your help. Yeah, you're welcome. I also found this missing pen. That pen must have fallen into the bag when I knocked it over. You can keep it if you like. Thanks, maybe now that there's no more mess, I can ask you a few questions. How can I be of service? Do you know a puffle named Flair? Why, yes! 
Flav used to be the only Puffle who could boil the water hot enough for the triple fudge cocoa drink. When was the last time you saw Flair? Flair came by yesterday, but I was too busy to play. I was learning how to make uh, the new triple fudge cocoa drink with our coffee machine. Does Flair have other friends? Flair spends a lot of time playing games with the snowball crew. They're probably at the snow fort right now. Don't worry, I'm going to take good care of Flair. Thank you so much. Alright, so let's go to the... Um, I'll, I'll go to the pet shop first and then we go to the snow fort because I believe there's someone over here who knows a lot of about puffles. Let's see, there's some here. Uh, and... Uh, oh, Alright, here's someone. Uh, welcome to the pet shop. How can I help you? Do you know what could make a puffle act strangely? Puffles are very friendly pets. If they are acting strangely, then they might need some attention. What seems to be the problem? I need to find a way to make a puffle feel better. Sometimes puffles need a bit of a fuzz. You should try doing something nice for the puffle. I know a black puffle that can start its flame. Black puffles can always start a flame, as long as they are happy. Thank you, you've been very helpful. That's what we are here for. Alright, so I need to make that puffle happy. And uh, I think the, we will have our answers in the snow forts. Alright, uh, the snow is nice today. Flair is going to love it. How do you know Flair? Flair once helped me signal Captain Rockhopper from the beacon. When was the last time you saw Flair? I thought Flair was still on vacation. The forts look great. Keep up the good work. Thanks, you are too kind. Oh, I'm not. And what about you? We're getting the snow forts ready for the next snowball fight with our fl friend Flair. Uh, that's kind of a tongue twister. How do you know Flair? Flair is a member of the snowball crew. That's the name of our group. Uh, when was the last time you saw Flair? The last time I saw Flair, I was too busy to play. It looks great. Keep up the good work. Thank you. Alright, so I believe Flair is a bit sad because he has no one to play with. A few moments later. Well, uh, I search everything and everywhere and I don't know. Let's go back to the dojo and see if we can make Flair feel happy with his postcard and the pen. Who knows? Alright. Uh, something seems wrong with Flair. A black puffle should be able to light up into a fireball just like that. Maybe it needs more berries. Where can I get some? I get my berries from the pet shop. The penguin there knows everything there is to know about uh, looking after puffles. We got to figure out what's got Flair feeling down. That's right, post Flair is counting on us. Alright, let me see. Maybe a postcard. I think Flair would like this postcard better if it said something. Oh! Let's combine the pen with the postcard. Alright, now Flair's friends can sign this, this card. Alright, well, let's go uh, speak to Flair's friends here at the snow fort. Alright, here, take this. I know Flair would love a postcard from all of his friends. I bet he would. He's writing something down. Alright. I don't know what it says, but there's room for three more signatures on this card. Alright, let's give this to this penguin over here. Uh, if this postcard is for Flair, I will sign a super special signature. Oh, nice. Thank you so much. Uh, there's room for two more signatures on this card. Alright, so two more uh, people, I mean penguins, can sign the card. I'm going to talk with Antarctic. She will probably sign this for him. Alright, here. Of course I'll sign this postcard for your puffle. Alright. Thank you. And there's room for one more. Later that same evening. Well, guys, I searched every place, but uh, I remember uh, that, uh, yeah, there is this penguin over here that still hasn't signed this uh, postcard, so I bet it's this one. You know, Flair's an unusual puffle. I bet it would love to get a postcard like this. Oh, nice, and we got our last uh, signature. Nice, Flair has a really great friends. Definitely. All right, well, I believe we have all the signatures. It took a while for me to figure this one out, 
but uh, we finally got it and let's give this to Flair here little guy I have something for you Flair look at him he's already so red man nice sweet and we got a postcard whoa Flair just fired up without using an Oberry that's amazing all Flair needed was to know that his friends missed it You've done a great job, Agent. Now I can show you how to work with Flair to fix your key. Oh, nice. So, let's see. To weld an object, first use the Puffle Whistle to call Flair to you. How do I weld something? First touch Flair and then touch the place where you want to weld. What if I touch something that can't be welded? Don't worry, Flair will know what to do. Alright, I'm ready to weld. Excellent. So, uh, let's uh, weld uh, this, the key that is broken. The key is good as new, now I can open the door to Gary's room at the sports shop. Nice! This is great, I got the key that Flair welded. Good job Flair, very proud of you. So now, let's see, Flair was pretty sh uh, stoked about that postcard. I bet he was. I guess we'll have to go now to the winter sports shop and see if we can open uh, Gary's room we have the key all fixed uh, we should be able to get into Gary's room right now let's try it the door is finally unlocked I knew this was the right key alright let's go inside so what do we have here there's a lot of pins this is the first one the shamrock then we have the music note and everyone every single pin to the rose that's really cool uh, we have screen hog over here, rocket snail and the coffee, that's awesome. So what's up with here, what's this? Why is she looking at maps of the mine? Uh, I found the map of the mine, alright that's interesting. Uh, I don't know what uh, we'll need it for but it's an empty notepad, I don't have use for it now. Alright, uh, what's this? Periodic table of elements, oh I remember studying that uh, at school. That's funny, a bit complicated but really interesting stuff. So this is like the planets uh, and things like that. This is our blueprints for a new gadget. The name of the device is encoded. Luckily I can use my spy gadget to decipher its meaning. Oh, secret message? Let's see. Uh, Alright, well I wasn't expecting this so yeah I will clean this up. And I'll be back once I figure what this message says. So yeah, be right back everyone. One eternity later. Alright, I'm back. It says super power flashlight. These look like G's plans. Alright, uh, G built a super power flashlight using these plans. So why do I need the plans for? To give it to him or something? Uh, look, there's a UFO on here. What is, what is all of this? Is Gary monitoring UFOs on space above Club Penguin or something? He has a webcam, a pretty wide monitor and a printer. There's a lava lamp and everything. This is very interesting stuff. Alright, well, uh, now what? One minute, 37 seconds later. Alright everyone, so after a very long time trying to understand the periodic table, I haven't found anything around here uh, and uh, I haven't understand uh, the periodic table either, so let's see, can I leave this place at least? I shouldn't leave without writing the other agents a message, but uh, I cannot write the message on the computer or anything. And uh, the other thing is this notepad. Oh, alright, so now I can write it down. I wrote a note for the other agents. Oh, okay, sure. Any agents who find my message can help me look for G in the mines. Oh, that's cool, alright. Well, uh, I guess we did it, can we leave now? Uh, it took some time, but I finally found the clues I was missing. Definitely, it took uh, quite some time, really. I'm sure that G went to the mine. I hope the other agents find my message and meet me there. Alright, well, uh, I guess we are done. Yep, mission complete. Congratulations, to Agent Tiger of Wind. You completed mission 5. Nice. So, well done. I did it. 
it was super fun maybe next episode we'll finally uh, meet Gary or find him somewhere probably on the mine or something and uh, yeah these missions are super fun to play really enjoying them and uh, if you are as well give this video a thumbs up it's very much appreciated subscribe if you haven't already and besides that thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next one everybody bye bye